Hello friends, Rentangle is a meditative art form that is a relaxing method of creating abstract art using structured patterns. It teaches and focuses on being mindful and present. Rentangle requires no artistic skills. Welcome to our 31 days of Zen, the October project, Magical Stars. I'm Samya Manne, I'm an artist and a certified Rentangle teacher. In this channel, we talk about creating and practicing Rentangle, my own Rentangle inspired artworks and collectibles. Make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to our channel so you will not miss out on any videos that I post here throughout this month of October. It's day 22 today and we are working with string number 7 from the Magical Star template. To join the fun, click on the link www.sanyamanestudio.com slash magical star and get started right away. You can find all our previous projects from the series on the playlist Magical Stars. So for today's project, I'm working on a regular white round sandala tile with my black pen, pencil stuff, gold pen, white pen, some watercolors, and some gold paint. Go grab all your supplies and let's get started. On to tangling now. Okay, so here we are with day um, 22 and string number 7. So this is string number 7 and this is day 22. Um, you can find the strings by logging on to www.sanyamanestudio.com slash magical stars. So when you register, you get this template uh, to download and um, all the strings are in this. So I've traced string number 7 from the template. I'm working on a white round zendala tile. Um, so we're using 01 black micron or 08 black micron. Number 10 white um, gold jelly roll pencil stub, white charcoal pencil stub, um, some gold paint. Um, so, with that, we need the brush, water, and we'll also use some watercolors. So, these are the supplies that we need for today's session. Now, let's just get started. So, first thing first, I am going to ink the the lines so let's go ahead and let's start with inking Okay, so here this is all done. Now I'm going to add gold paint uh, on the star. So take your paint and let's start with that. So just added a bit of gold onto my palette, which is actually a plastic um, sheet. And I've just wet the brush. I'm not really adding water to this uh, mixture here. This has enough uh, um, moisture in it. So that's just enough to pull the paint out like this so we don't need to add any water if it's acrylic um, so I'm going to go around doing this
So take your time, go around and add gold to the star. Okay, so let's now I'm going to use my checker tip pen to add um, to redo the black lines. So go around and just redo the black lines. You can um, make a proper straight line. I'm just, I'm just goofing around here. Okay, so now that this is done, we are going to add colors in these uh, white sections. So let's go around, do that. Okay, so here for the section, I am going to use purple. I'm going to mix the colors purple and this uh, burnt sienna, the burnt umber. I'm going to mix burnt umber with some purple. So I get this lovely color. Now I'm going to add lots of water to this, like really dilute this. So this is going to be something like this. Uh, maybe more water. So let's go around adding this. Okay, so I'm going to let this dry for a minute and then we'll start working on the inner uh, section here. Okay, now for the center part, 
I'm gonna use um, this blue here. This is the Persian blue, and I'm gonna mix a bit of green to this, the Virgin green here, and it creates this lovely, lovely bluish green. And I'm gonna of course add a lot of water to this. Dilute this and this. We're gonna add in this section here. Okay, and for this section, we are going to add um, we're going to add this blue and some green. Okay, so let's see how this goes out. So, I'm going to add this blue. This is like the the indigo blue so I'm adding that and the green Okay, so I'm going to let this dry and then we'll get to adding the tangles. Okay, so I'm going to start with um, a simple pattern here. So I'm just adding circle like this and I'm going out adding petals like that. Okay, and we're just going to add some circles here. Okay, I'm adding the black and those little gaps. So now here in this section, I'm going to add this tangle called Breeze. Um, so here it goes like this. We're going to pull out a center line and um, we are going to go along adding. So this is an aura line and then a wider band and then an aura line, some a wider band, aura line. So we're going to alter. Okay, and then I'm going to use my ticketed pen and add black here like this. So we're going to skip this, so keep that the color it is, and then we're going to add black in the next one. So we're going to alternate between black and no black. Okay, so let's do this again here. The next one, pull out a straight line, ok, 
okay so i'm just adding these bands and aura lines like this so i am now going in to add black Okay, so take your time, go around and add rays in each of these sections. Okay, so now this is all done. Now we're going to work in this section. So I'm going to start with um, this tangle called flux. So this is uh, more like Maria's flux. So it goes like this, and we make a nice head, bulb of head like that, and then pull out another one on this side this goes like this now I'm going to pull out another layer okay and another layer here okay so let's go ahead and have some tipples there. Okay, so now I'm going to order this. Okay, so I'm just going to add a circle here. And then over here, I am going to pull out line like this from the corners this is almost like a triangle so from the corners i'm just putting out lines and i'm going to do um something like in ripple so i go over the line but just at the corners i round it up so only the corners are rounded but pretty much i go over the line like that so let's do that here as well Okay, so I'm just going to go back in and add black in these gaps. Okay, so let's beat this here.
Okay. So let's put that on the side as well. Okay, so take your time, go around and finish the rest. Hey, so here this is all done. I love the way this is turned out. So uh, let's get to shading. Before that, I have these little white spots going to it. I'm just going to add black in here and fill that up. Okay, so now let's get to shading. Uh, let me get my supplies here. Okay, so first thing first, I'm just going to go along the star. Okay, so this is done. Now I'm going to add some gold here. Okay, and now I'm going to add a little bit of white lines like that. So for braids, I'm just going to go along one side like this and we're going to blend that out. Like that. Okay, so now here I am going to add some pencil, blend this out, and then add some white here, like that. So I'm going to go around doing this. Okay, and then I take the white. So I take the white and I'm just going to add some dots like this. Okay, 
and I'm also going to take some okay let's see how this looks I'm just going to add some white here no I'm going to take some gold pen and I'm going to just add some gold here Okay, and I'm going to add uh, the same black and white like this and I'm going to add some dots so I'm going to go around doing this um, in each of our sections Okay, and I'm just going to add some gold here. Okay, so take your time, go around and finish the rest okay so here this is all done i like the way this looks now we're going to add um some white um additions here so i'm just going to go around adding a circle at the corners here and then i'm going to pull out a wavy line like this so take your time go around and do this that okay so it's all done we have added the white on the star as well so now let's journal this so i'm going to add my maybe here somewhere now let's journal this so this is um today's date is 22nd of october 2022 and this is day 22 of magical stars and uh, this is string number seven okay so we started off with um brace and some flux this is my just flux and then we did an zeppel so these are the tangles that we've used here there it is all done hope you had fun on this project with me i would love to see your creations so head on to our Facebook group, Wendy's, where all the after party fun happens. Share your creations there and check out the works by other Wendy's. If you're sharing your works on social media, then please do tag me at Sanya Mane or hashtag MagicalStars. So I get to see your lovely works there and I do stop by to comment. 
A quick note, these projects and these videos are for your personal use and no part of this can be used for any kind of commercial purposes. To understand the Centangle method and to get started on your own Centangle journey, check out my website www.sanyamanestudio.com for classes, courses and workshops. Now it's time to comment, so please comment and let me know how you enjoyed this project. If a starter will help me, now I an exit of videos. Also it's time to show some love, so hit that like button, share the video and subscribe to the channel. To join uh, the fun of Magical Stars, log on to www.sanyamanyastudio.com slash Magical Stars. Okay, then I will see you tomorrow with another project. Until then, remember to breathe and smile. See ya. Namaste. Thank you.